now, CBS 46 Pinpoint Weather, certified Atlanta's most accurate forecast. The dogs are in the SEC championship and we are here for it. If you're an Alabama fan, you know, you're just you're used to winning, right? But we're all hoping for a good game, a rematch of the national championship, if you will. Tua, you're going down. Hopefully, fingers crossed guys for the game. If you are going to be tailgating, light showers are possible pretty much all day. Those are going to continue through the evening as well. It's not going to be a complete washout. That's the good news, but I would plan on it being a pretty wet day in general. 61 degrees, but look how much colder it is. Just a few miles up to the north. Temperatures are in the 40s. Rome, Canton, Gainesville still quite chilly. 42 in LJ. That's where the cold air is still pooled. Same as yesterday, but for us here in Atlanta and down the south, Temperatures are up almost 20 degrees and that warmth is going to surge north through the overnight hours. You can see spotty showers are possible through the evening, but overall we're just gonna be dealing with mostly cloudy skies by 10 p.m. Most areas will be sitting near 50 degrees and that's where temperatures will hover overnight. So warmer by tomorrow morning than it is right now for LJ, Rome, Canton and Gainesville. Some light showers are possible for the northern tier tomorrow morning, but those will actually clear out after around the time that we eat lunch and by tomorrow at this time, I do expect the sun to begin to come out. So temperatures will be in the 60 degree range tomorrow. Once again, another system is going to develop on Saturday. That's going to be the feature that brings us all that rain. You can see though, no yellow, no orange, no red. So no severe weather and no very heavy rain, just light showers that are going to be pretty pesky through the afternoon and evening hours. And those will actually continue overnight into Sunday. So I'm going with a 70% chance of rain because at times it will be dry through the day on Saturday. Not a reason to cancel your plans and the back half of Sunday is going to be dry and beautiful with highs near 70 degrees.